we will get right to it. Onondaga County jumping to six confirmed cases now of the coronavirus that was announced this afternoon just minutes ago at a news conference. Oneida County has just added a second confirmed case of coronavirus today, and Tompkins County remains at three positive cases. No others have tested positive in central New York. And remember, only county and state health departments and government offices are able to confirm those positive cases. So, News Channel 9's Andrew Donovan was at that news conference when the newest cases of COVID-19 were announced in Onondaga County. Andrew, what do we know about these cases? This is all new to us. Christy, we don't know much because the county executive learned about it moments before taking part in an, a, another announcement. We're here at the Philanthropy Center where the county executive was part of the announcement that a fund has been started basically to raise money for the nonprofit organizations that are already starting to hurt from all of the changes because of the coronavirus, whether it's formula for babies or delivering meals. Those charities need to pay for the services they offer. but. The county executive used that opportunity to update the number of cases in Onondaga County. Now, six total, and we have a list for you of all six. The first two on the list we learned about earlier this week the woman in her 70s and her husband, that couple. Then the cases continued. This morning, the county executive was informed of the third positive case. That's a woman in her 20s who we're told traveled from New York City. They believe that the the contain the people who may have been contaminated by her is a very small number because she got in the car with her mom and then drove to central New York where she was tested. Then these three new cases that the county executive just learned of moments ago. He doesn't have much information, but they include a traveler again from New York City, a traveler from Spain, and the third new case today is a, a person in their 20s. He was not able to release the gender or more information, but they are under the presumption it's another case of community spread. That means this person probably caught it in Onondaga County. Here's a little bit of what the county executive had to say about community spread versus a traveler. When we get a positive, there you never want a positive, but if, there, if it's a traveling situation, they contracted it in another community and now they're home. Okay, so that's better than uh, certainly a community spread situation where our investigation it goes on for a little bit. The county executive will uh, join us live on News Channel 9 coming up at 5 o'clock, uh, updating us again on any new information he gets about these cases. But he wants to remind the community more people are being tested, so it's normal that the number of positive cases is going up, so don't be too surprised. But now we're at six as of right now. Live in Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9.